you can use LaTeX to write formula in Brightspace. Please note that the math type is not supported. If you want to upload documents containing math type text, it is recommended to insert the text as images or save the documents as .pdf before uploading. In this video, we will look into two ways you can add formula using LaTeX. One, text editors when adding content to your course, and two, grades tool to do advanced grade calculations. When using the text editor, click on the Show All Components icon. This will reveal the LaTeX editor. Click to expand the drop-down menu on the right to the sigma symbol and choose LaTeX Equation from the list. The LaTeX Equation Editor will open. You can start typing your formula. There are also guidelines provided. Simply click on which LaTeX commands are supported to view them. As you type, a preview will appear just below the text box. Once complete, click on Insert. You can now continue writing the rest of the text in the text editor and click Publish, or Save as a draft and to save it. The second option is to use formula to calculate an existing calculated grade, such as the final calculated grade, or you can create a new calculated grade and insert the formula there. To add formula to an existing grade, click to expand its settings menu and select Edit Grade Item. Below grading, you can set the maximum points and click on Edit using the formula to define the points received. Type your formula in the space provided and click Insert. To insert a formula to a calculated grade calculation, go to Grades and open the Manage Grades tab. Click on New and select Item. You can now click to select either the formula or calculated grade. Make sure your gradebook is using formula as a grading system. You can check this by running the setup wizard in grades and check this option in step 1. In both cases, give the grade column a name and type the maximum points in the field provided. Then click on edit using formula and insert your formula. In the Brightspace support website, you can find an overview of some of the functions that you can use as well as a few practical examples to follow.